destroyed. We're uh, still in the bracket. This is for the people that aren't in the bracket. Yeah, boy. We suck, that's why we commentate. Yo, so there were some jiffies in that last game. Yeah. Not gonna lie. Yo, Hyperfly's been going for nothing but giffies today. What are you doing? Are you struggling? Are you Crescent struggling? Crescent Monkey does not know how good headphones work. No, apparently not. Not these, like, cool, fancy... Yo, that medium tech headphones. Freaking Gamer with his money, like, these $200... Headsets. They're so comfortable. They are. They're very nice. Well, we should bring back the my ears for each other. The best. <laughs> you could just default to that when you were commentating. You had nothing to say. <laughs> Dude, my ears my hurt. Ear. Yeah, me too. What a coincidence. <laughs> I wonder why. Captain Falcon. The classic <laughs> matchup. All right, so Remo and Hyperflame. We're going to Battlefield. Hyperflame. Unless they're doing butt checks. But he was known for being like technical. Yeah. He was also not known for being as good as he is now. I feel like his Falcon problem is gone. But when you have a character problem like that, sometimes it's hard to. It's irrelevant. Get rid of. Irrelevant. He's gonna. He's gonna do it. I was watching their friendlies earlier, they were actually playing, and Hyperflame was doing very well, so this could definitely happen. Okay. okay. Yeah, I think Falcon does well against Psy children, yeah. in general. He used to be much better against Lucas, because in like 3.0 you could just up throw anything Lucas. Yeah. But since the, since the ever so slight nerf to Falcon's up throw, you can't reach Lucas with anything, right, until like 40. So your combos aren't nearly as free. So they're just defaulting to tech chases? Yeah, it's like down throw. I mean, maybe Remo will do something Three, that I don't know. Two, or the king one, of Okay, okay. Alright, so starting off Smash Bros. Well. It feels like a harder combo than it was. Yeah, there's the down throw. That was the up throw in 2.0, and he got like 80 all the way. Wow, Reese's jump. Yep. Oh, oh, wow. Okay. Remo is strong. Falcon jumps like that, you have to. That's oh. like a 50-50 that Falcon will go for all the time. Wow. Well, that DI too. See, he already went for it again. So this is an up throw? Oh. Yeah, he's an up throw for set now. He probably yeah. was too scared of like missing the combo off stage. Because that was like mine. Yeah, that was all. This is definitely up throw. Got that odd reverse hit on I'm the magnet. I'm not seeing the combos for my group. It might take a minute. But I know that he has a well, it's hard to get something started when they're still in crouch cancel percent. Here we go now. Oh, yep. That's how he just made it. That's I don't really know how that made but like, that's, that's, that's what Hyper Lane does. It's like, how did you do that? <laughs> <laughs> it just did. I don't know, it just did. Or he'll just, like, pull out the Okay. Episode. Yeah, he'll cover a lot of things. I don't agree with that. That would definitely Up throw. Ooh, oh, misses the knee. It's just, it was short hop and Ooh, his juggles. Yeah, you have to watch out against him. Um, this is actually pretty good against him. Weak knee gonna take it? No! He got greedy for the downer, but it's okay. This is pretty even right now. Uh, not so. Ooh, misses the knee. Awesome. I'm surprised he didn't go for, like, back air after that. A lot of the times when you get soft knee, that's how you save it. You get the first soft knee in the back air and they die anyway. Okay. Well, yeah, soft knee. Like, wow, you're so good, but actually, you're just screwed up. Soft knee comes into so much for Falcon. I'm surprised Remo did that. Attack. That's like his jam. So, what? after <laughs> that first zero to death, Hyperflame has brought this back and taken a bit of a lead. Yeah. It's still really even, though. Yep. Yeah. They're both on two stocks. Kind of surprised with that. But Here's the combo. This could be big. Oh, no he gets it clipped by the getup attack. It never feels like it's gonna be big, but we That's it. against the Falcon. So it's looking like Hyperflame really needs to just survive to higher percents, and Remo's really struggling to get those kills. Yeah, that time wow. was really like 
he, he did a good job that time of taking the stock early with that swap team. Yep. But then Hyperflame just takes it right back. And I feel like he's been doing fine in the game. His combos just haven't been quite as hard. Up throw. Up there. there you go. Oh. That was scary. For both of us. It's one of those situations that. Oh, here we go. Is this going to be it? Uh, okay. Yeah, Misses the tech chase. That was also quite out. We went for a hard command, but it worked out. Hyper flame. Oh, no, the hyper flame right. oh, oh wow. Kicked I out think of that it. That was an unfair game. But maybe he won't kick out of There it is. There it is. There's a classic hyper flame. Just deck is in neutral. Yeah. <laughs> you know, whoever just said my character is so bad in the chat, just practice a little bit more. Make your character good. Roy is godlike on stage. Yeah. It's not looking so good off stage. Though. Yeah, but off stage, <laughs> not looking off so stage, he's kind of like Falco. Yeah. Except his recovery is actually. It's not like as good. I don't know. Where's my project recovery? Three, yeah. <laughs> One, go. Goes back to Smashville. It was a close match, so I can understand why. Yeah. Well, and personally, I think it's always better to just pick the stage you're most comfortable with, even if it's not necessarily the best for the matchup. Remo did a crap release off stage there. Uh, he's a pretty big fan of that. He's done it for me. The thing about grab release off stage is that if you're not holding up with this wall, it's really bad at you and it's like actually bad at you. Part. But if you do know about it, you can just up there, not up there, you can just hold up and fly up and just not hold it anymore. You can just come back to the level completely on the Alright. Look at Crescent Monkey spitting the knowledge. Alright. That was definitely the only first time. <laughs> Hyperflame's been trying to get a lot of these Kipcom level Gippy Cats with footstools. It's because he's in the chat. He's like, Senpai is watching. <laughs> Down, Ooh. stomped a knee. That still works. Yeah. And everyone still goes crazy over it. Yeah, even though it's unbelievably easy. What are you talking about? It's the hardest, <laughs> this is the hardest thing to ever hit, man. Come on. Oh, Reza Tech. Oh, oh that's barely misses. Oh. He made it back, but I feel like that's not very good. Yeah, he's sh- Wait, oh, what wow. was that? That was- That was- I don't know. That's tether like recoveries being yeah, bad. I feel like Thanks, that Pam. wasn't kind of small, it kind of Yeah, I agree. Thanks, Brawl Physics. Oh. Okay, Interesting. That, I feel like that's something that should have worked in 3.02, but it, it's- I don't know if it worked on it. I know that that was definitely a thing on the spaces. I like the retreat back on the stage. Yeah, I thought for sure he was going to try and go out there, but he had nothing. Yeah, he definitely did not. It was good DI. Remo's actually but read a lot of Hyperflint's text. He just hasn't been able to capitalize as well. Yeah. Oh, this combo extension. Tilt. Soft knee. That's it. No, oh, nope. He had his jump. There it is. But the stomp. I still don't like that, but it worked out this time. Well, I mean, there wasn't really an option for him to cover with the way he was recovering unless he, like, dipped down and, like, back aired him. Yep. I would have preferred if he, like, stayed on the ledge and then pressed him into the video. But that's scary, because then if you miss that, like, he hits you with the knee and you get to make the fight. True. But at least it's not like Nessus where it's like in one go it's a multi hit. Yeah. And he was and he got it anyway. Oh, interesting. Oh, again, he reads the tech but just doesn't cover it properly. Yeah, like Remo's been actually reading all of Hyperflink's text. He just hasn't been covering it as well. But, oh, wow, that was, that was nice. Was, nice detail, that was but. Really good to see. Oh, see, he read it again. Oh, he missed the. Oh, twice! He missed the L cancel that time. Just, if you ever play against the Falcon. Have that option to take it. Don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> it seems like the good option because they're gonna like run at you and stomp, but actually all they have to do is like stomp in place and just sad. 
Especially on battlefield platforms. If you're right on the middle of the platform, don't take it. They'll just like double jump on you. Three, two, Goes the PS2. One, go! Ouch. It's just, that's just right. such a rough start. It could have been a lot worse. If you get hit with me at the first time, a lot of the times it's a combo. Yeah. He didn't get a grab or anything off of it. Wow. Interesting option, but no punish. Yeah, yep. he, he missed time. Or he, I don't know how to defeat but he didn't know how much he That's like the third Rodney Remo's gotten at the beginning of that. It in that first stock. Yeah, it's just calling out his movement a lot. Yep. Wow. That is what you were talking about, the 0% need leading to a combo. Yeah, it's usually not. Oh, that's just it. What? That was Nairs him across the stage. And it just has to hold ledge, and that'll be it. So pretty yep. even, 36%, it's almost up throw percent. Now it's up throw percent. Or... Wow. Or he could just, just up air wobble him. Air wobble into a breast. Ooh, interesting. I love Hyper's turnarounds with the yeah. magnet. It's I, beautiful. I can't do that. I can't. No. <laughs> you can't push the buttons fast enough? I'm left handed. Okay, no fair enough. Yeah. You got no it. <laughs> you got it. Getting Ooh. Interesting choice to up smash. I feel I like he could have continued the combo. I feel like he might have wanted to. Oh. That was cute. 83% Yeah, this is super doable. And he didn't get the full charge on the. Yeah, he hasn't been able to get the full charge. Nope. Mainly because Falcon doesn't die off the Okay, top. there's the up tilts. Up tilt juggling. That's, That's like what, the uh... He didn't want and got the Smash 4 Mario combos, just up tilt. That Ooh! The, the Interesting. And that's a dead if Falcon. If you play against Falcon for long enough in your game, like, I'm done with this. Let me lose the stock and get combos. Yep. Oh, that's a disappointing end. Good stuff.